everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Uh, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits. Crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense sage, protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on on jamiezebra23.com. Also, um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Keep in mind that the readings are general, so this is not, they are not personal readings, so they may or may not resonate. So please be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising videos for further insight. Also, keep in mind... Um, that um, you must place an order before I can schedule you. So there's no need to email me and ask me what's on the website when you can simply go to the website and check yourself, right? So, um, and if you have any questions about the items on my website, you simply go to the description box of the item on the website and it tells you the times, the dates, um, when you should hear back from me, what the protocol is, all of that can simply be found by just going to the website and looking at the description. All right, guys, uh, please like, share, subscribe, and comment. Ta-ta for now. Hi my Tauruses, it's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your weekly spread for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. Let's see what the energies are for the week. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope life is good. So we do have the judgment, so change of position on something. The Nine of Wands. So for some of you, maybe somebody is judging you and you'll have to defend yourself. Maybe somebody's making gossip about you, making up stories about you, lies about you. Maybe somebody's got the wrong idea and you have to defend yourself, Five of Swords. Um, it looks like if you communicate what, whatever the stress is or whatever the confusion is, it'll be fixed. Could have to do with a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius man or a woman. There's also a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius man or woman that's either having a miscarriage, they're sick, they're ill, they're, um, they caught something, they're not doing well. Maybe they're being spiritually attacked. Let me see what else. The Four of Swords. Maybe somebody's upset because they're going to jail. On one hand, somebody's upset that they're going to jail and then there's other people around that are excited and waiting for this. The Six of Pentacles, liberation. Somebody's liberated. Somebody's gonna feel liberated. Justice will be served. There's somebody that's been causing, wreaking havoc and chaos in someone's life and they're being removed. So this could be through the legal system or this could be through, um, you know, through karma, you know, maybe somebody's going to make this person relocate so that they can't stalk someone or bother someone. Maybe if you've got a coworker that's mean to you, maybe the coworker's going to go. If you've got neighbors that are effed up and they're horrible to you, maybe the neighbors are going to be gone. But either way, something's going to change for the better here. So it's the, the negative person is in trouble. The good person is going to be liberated. Let me see what else. And then we got the Hierophant. So it could be um, a fellow Taurus. The Seven of Cups. Okay. Two of Pentacles. The Wheel of Fortune. Okay. There could be somebody. Um, there could be a fellow Taurus that feels entitled to somebody's money. That feels entitled to somebody's finances or someone's success. They want to get paid for something. So maybe there's a Taurus. Um, with the Seven of Cups, it's usually like illusions or... Um, mental problems. So there could be somebody who feels like they're owed something, but they're not owed anything. And somebody has a hard time understanding why they think they're owed something. So this could be a Taurus on Taurus relationship, or if you're cross watching, this could be a Taurus. Maybe, I don't know, maybe you broke up with someone and then you won the lottery. So they're like, well, we used to date you know, like 10 years ago, and now you won the lottery, so you should give me half. Somebody's logic isn't, the wires are disconnected. Something's not, yeah, the lines are very crossed and tied up and twisted and knotted up. It's like, make it make sense. So there's, there's an illusion here. Somebody's not mentally stable. 
I also feel like maybe somebody's didn't date someone, has never dated them. Now they're getting, now somebody that they're fantasizing about is getting married and they're like, you're going to pay for this. How dare you cheat on me? But you're like, I don't know you. I don't know you. There, some of you are dealing with somebody who's really mentally unstable. So just um, don't engage. If possible, just don't engage with this person. It does look like it could be a, a fellow Taurus. So if it's Taurus on Taurus energy or if you're cross-watching. Now let's talk about something else. Okay, so yeah, so we got the Seven of Cups, the Two of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune. So somebody got out of a relationship and then they got successful. Somebody's feeling brokenhearted about that. Um, this could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo, or a Scorpio that ended a relationship with Taurus, or Taurus, you ended it with them, and then you got really successful, or they got really successful. There's somebody who ended a relationship, and as soon as they did, money money was in their pocket. Could even be a fire sign, a Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. The Page of Wands, yeah, it could be a big emphasis on fire. Big emphasis on a fire sign who's who's very successful. Then we got the Emperor, which could be a Taurus, could be an Aries. The Knight of Pentacles. Okay, it's saying that an Earth sign or an Aries took too long. They were moving too slow. And it looks like a Leo successful. So there, there was an Aries or a Taurus that moved too slow and that... Um, or they didn't believe in the relationship. So maybe somebody was just starting something. They were just getting started on whatever they had going on. And maybe a Taurus or an Aries was impatient. It ended and then now the person's like at the top of their game. I'm hearing music. I'm hearing like piano. I'm hearing instruments. So I don't know. I don't know what that is. I don't know if that's the orchestra. I don't know if that's like background music for like a TV show. I'm not sure what it is, but whatever this is, somebody's coming up. And it may not have to do with music. That's just one of the things that I heard. And then we do have the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. So somebody, somebody lost a legacy. Somebody lost their fortune. It's gone. They don't have a chance for that anymore. They got to find something else. You know, we can't, yeah, Five of Swords. Somebody knows, or Five of Pentacles. Somebody knows that they lost. So, you know, I know a lot of Tauruses, and Tauruses are really good people, so I always get shocked when I hear these things. Um, but for whoever this is for, you know, sometimes we have to give up. So sometimes, you know, if a relationship doesn't work or we've made a mistake, you know, we have to just live with it and move on. So you know what? Maybe that person wasn't for you. Yeah, maybe they do have a lot of riches now. Maybe they do have a lot of success. Maybe they're killing it. Maybe it's you, Taurus. Maybe it's the other person. Either way, whoever is feeling like that could have been my life or damn, you know, this person better take me back. I'm going to call them up right now and they better just take me back and, and let me have a cut of that money or let me be a part of it in some way, somehow. Um, that's not going to happen and things don't work that way. So the best thing to do is to move on and find someone else. Just go find your new happiness, but maybe this time don't, you know, throw something out prematurely. So whether this is you, Taurus, or the cross watcher, just learn from your mistakes and keep it moving. All right, guys, um, if you ordered a $10 one question, one answer via email only or a same day reading and you've not heard from me within about 45 minutes, feel free to email me to let me know so I can hurry up and answer your questions, hurry up and do your readings. Also, the reading special is still going on for a few more hours on jamiezebra23.com. Um, the Knight of Pentacles came out. I'll read that after I'm done. Um, reading specials are done in 7 to 10 days after purchase. If you don't want to wait 7 to 10 days after purchase to get a reading special, you can always order a same-day reading, which is done the same day, or you can order a regular reading, which is done in 24 to 72 hours. Um, if you... Um, um, I've got a second tarot card channel, Jimmy Zebra 23 chat. If you guys want to go over there, like, share, subscribe, and comment, that would be super duper lovely. Uh, by the time this video uploads, the X's and O's, um, singles, are they going to call and what's their next move for October 2020 should be posted. Also, um, yeah. So let me tell you guys what these two cards are that flew out. Okay. We do have the Knight of Pentacles and we do have the Six of Cups. So it, it shows here that maybe somebody who took a long, long time reaching out to you from the past, they're now coming back. It could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo, or this could be a um, Cancer Pisces or a Scorpio. Or this could be any energy that took a long time, because the Knight of Pentacles moves very, very slow. So if this Knight of Pentacles is planning on doing something, 
It'll take them six months to actually do it. It'll take them a year to do it. It might take them five years. They, they move slow. They think slow. They really got to think about it. But what the, the bad part about this is usually when these, whoever this energy is for, the person usually misses opportunities quite often because they're thinking. So if somebody knows that something or someone is a good fit, a good catch, profitable, um, a good decision, somebody, somebody or something that's gold, if you wait too long, of course somebody else is going to take it. So it looks like maybe somebody waited too long. Now that they see that everyone else wants it, now they're like, okay, I'm here. But the decision's already been made. You're six months too late. You're 10 years too late. Bye. <laughs> so um, this could be a warning. So for those of you that are procrastinators, stop procrastinating. For those of you that are um, that dealt with someone like this and they're now coming back, don't feel obligated to say yes. If you've got someone better in your life, just say no. All right, my Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers, have an amazing week. JamieZebra23.com to top right now. JamieZebra23. Sorry to interrupt the reading, but if you guys are interested in a personal reading, you can simply go to the first 30 seconds of this video, and it tells you um, where to make a purchase, JamieZebra23.com. It tells you about the same-day readings, so you don't have to wait. Same-day readings. Also an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you with about 20 minutes. Plus, I've got tons of products on the website for protection, for cleansing, for energetic healing, all sorts of goods on the website, jamiezebra23.com. You simply go to the first 30 seconds of the video, and it will explain all of this stuff. No need to email me to ask me if I do personal readings when you can simply go to the first 30 seconds, and also the description box says it too. jamiezebra23.com. Enjoy the rest of your reading. Hi everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23 so I have a fans-only account if you guys want to skip over there and um, check it out. It's uh, pretty much for guys. Um, it's not that raunchy, but it may be a little bit of fun. Jamie Zebra 23 touch off for now.